Has your addiction to porn and masturbation caused you to miss out on finding the joy, the satisfaction, the excitement that all of this life has to offer? Stick around for today's video, guys, because in today's video, I'm going to share with you how porn has hijacked your dopamine and what you need to do to take back control of your reward center, reboot, rewire your brain, and become the man that you were created to be. But before we jump into today's video, guys, we remind you who we are and what we do here. My name is Frank Rich, CEO and founder and head coach at Rebuilt Recovery, and it is our mission to help men break free from the shackles of porn addiction through the power of faith and fitness. Now, we do that in a handful of different ways. First off, right here on the Rebuild Your Life YouTube channel, we are releasing new videos every single day, Monday through Friday at this point. So if you're new to the channel and haven't done so yet, make sure to hit that subscribe button right there. And also turn those post notifications on so you are notified every single time a new video is released. And secondly, if you guys are in the early stage of trying to identify all the ways in which porn is having a negative impact on your life and are curious about what life can look like for you once you've been able to remove this destructive habit out of your life, make sure to download our free ebook. It's the seven step guide to living life without porn, where I walk you through the exact process and system that we use with our students and clients here at Rebuild Recovery and how to identify all those ways in which porn is having a negative impact on your life. How to then take that and build a proactive plan to get you out of the depths of this addiction and step into the life that you were created to live. But most importantly, what do you need to do daily to hold yourself accountable, to build up the discipline, to build up the willpower, and actually execute upon your plan every single day. So you can not just quit porn in the short term, but you can begin to live that porn-free life that we like to talk about here at Rebuild Recovery. So that's a seven-step guide to living life without porn. I'm going to link it down there in the first pinned comment below. So after today's video, guys, if you haven't done so yet, make sure to visit the page and download the book. But let's get back to today's video, guys. How can you take back control of your dopamine? How can you reboot, reset your reward center so that you can fight pornography and this addiction to porn and masturbation forever and ultimately step into the life that you were created to live? But before we can talk about how to take back control, I think it's important for us to understand what is actually occurring. How has porn hijacked us? So I know for me, for a very long time, it's like I, I, I struggled and suffered with depression and anxiety and fear and just inadequacy. And I, and I wasn't really able to connect it. So I really discovered uh, Gary Wilson's book, Your Brain, on, Your Brain on Porn. So if you guys haven't done so yet, I highly recommend reading Your Brain on Porn by Gary Wilson because it takes a deep, deep look at the brain science. Also, I've done multiple conversations with Dr. Trish Lee here. But in short... What ends up happening from first or second exposure to pornography, you've reestablished a new baseline for your dopamine, for your reward center. And the only way that you're going to get that same level of stimulus, that same hit, is to seek out and find more pornography. Now, because it's been hijacked by this supernormal stimulus, the things in life that were designed and created to give you dopamine, like the completion of goals, the working towards an achievement in your life, the completion of a task at hand, all these things that were designed to give us dopamine so that we can move forward in life and we can create meaning in the world, those have been hijacked because the only place you're going to get more and more dopamine is in the pursuit of pornography. I literally had a conversation with a client the other day and he's he's coming up you know in in, in and he's reaching the point where he's fully rebooted and fully reestablished and he caught himself sitting there in front of the computer and he's like what am i doing i can literally feel my brain changing as he was thinking about going back and relapsing and it was an aha moment for him because he realized that the hits that he had been getting it wasn't in the completion of porn and masturbation it was in the pursuit of it so now that we understand how dopamine works dopamine is a chemical it's a neuromodulator that is designed to be released when you're working towards the attainment of a goal. So a lot of people understand this from a physical standpoint. Maybe you've gone out and set out, I want to lose 15 pounds, I want to lose 20 pounds, whatever the goal is. A lot of people are going to associate the completion of that task with that's when I'm going to get the feel good chemicals. And that's not actually the case. Dopamine is meant to be released when you're working towards the completion of a goal. So if you've set the goal to lose 15 pounds, then every day when you wake up and you deny the junk food, you deny the cake and, and choose for the chicken and broccoli, you choose for the, the beef and rice, whatever it is in your meal plan, by making that choice and choosing the right food that's going to move you closer towards your goal, you're getting a hit of dopamine. Same thing when you're when you're driving towards the gym. It's not at the end of the workout. It's not the end of the 90-day transformation. It's in every small step moving towards your goal that you get to hit a dopamine. So how does this work in helping you break out of your porn and masturbation addiction? Well, if we understand that porn is what's hijacked our 
dopamine, then we A need to cut that off. But how do we reset, reestablish, and reboot that dopamine? Well, you have to start by creating specific attainable goals in your life. So what we teach our students and clients here at Rebuild Recovery is to paint a vision for your life three to five years in the future. Think about the man that you need to become to no longer be addicted to pornography and put it down on paper and aim big, aim really, really big. Think of all the things that porn has prevented you from accomplishing in your life and then set them as the target, set them as the aim. Now that's, that's the first step, but if all you did is you had an idea of what you wanted your life to be like in five years, then it wouldn't actually work as far as resetting, reestablishing, and taking back control of your reward center. So we gotta have the bigger target set forth there. Now we gotta break this down into an actionable plan. What are things that I need to be doing today, this week, next week, next month? And by taking the bigger goal and breaking it down into an actionable plan, you now have steps that are gonna lead you toward your goal. So if you've broken down five years, this is who I wanna be, and I know what I need to do this week. Then when you wake up in the morning and you have your plan there in front of you, you know exactly what steps need to take place in order for you to reach your goal. So let's take it back to understanding what dopamine is. Dopamine is a chemical that is released when we take the proper steps towards our goal. So by having the plan of who I want to become five years in the future, then having it broken down into an actionable plan today, tomorrow, the next day, the following week, when I wake up tomorrow and I have my plan and I start working towards that, actually executing upon the plan that I designed and laid out for myself. And this is the key guys, because this requires a, a little bit of work and effort and execution on your end. It's not just create the plan and think that it's going to do all the work on and of itself. It's create the plan and then show up daily and execute upon your plan. And then by executing upon the plan that you created to become the man that is no longer addicted to porn, when you take the step today, when you take the step tomorrow, when you execute upon the plan next week, this is what's gonna reset, reboot, and rewire your reward center. Because you're gonna get hits of dopamine as you're working towards becoming that man that is no longer addicted to porn. So it's a simple process, guys. It's very easy. You want to take back control of your dopamine, create a plan for your life on becoming the man that you want to become, and then break it down into actionable steps every single day that you can execute upon. And then when you execute upon those steps every single day, reward and acknowledge yourself for doing the things that are bringing you closer to the goal that you've set for yourself. And that is how you reset your dopamine. That is how you take back control of your reward center so you begin to find joy, pleasure, happiness, excitement, and all the right things in this world. Over time, this will be the unwiring and rewiring process. So now when you wake up, you're excited about attacking your plan. You're no longer chasing pornography for the hit of dopamine because your life is designed in a way that's gonna give you dopamine hits all day long. And it's a powerful, incredible place to be, but it takes execution, Secondly, after having a plan. So if you're if you're struggling with, I don't know what to do. I don't know. I, I my brain is hurting, and the only way I can make it feel better is by seeking out and getting more pornography. Then your number one goal right now is to sit down and create a plan for your life, three to five years in the future, on who is the man that you need to become in order to no longer look at pornography. And it's very important that you pay attention to the words that I spoke there. Who do you need to become to no longer look at pornography? Take responsibility for your actions, take responsibility for your life, and take responsibility for creating the life that you were put on this earth to live. And that's it, guys. That is the formula. If I've never done another video on this topic again, if you just watch this over and over and over and actually execute upon exactly what I told you to do today, your life will change. I can guarantee it. You will no longer struggle with this issue. You will break out of this cycle. You will end the fight with porn and masturbation, and you will become the man that you were intended to be. Really hope today's video spoke to you guys. If it did, I want you to drop this comment down there below. What is your big takeaway? What is the number one thing that you need to do today completely as soon as you shut this video off? I want to hear from you guys down there below. Drop the comment down there in the comment section. But like I said at the beginning of the video, guys, we're releasing videos every single day, Monday through Friday. So if you're new and you have not done so yet, please hit that subscribe button. Turn those no notifications on so you're notified every single day when the new videos are released. But Frank Cruz from Rebuild Recovery, helping you guys get clear and understand on how you can end this fight with PMO addiction by taking back control of your dopamine and resetting your reward center. I'll see you guys on the other side.